Hey, this is Spencer Sue, your Bay Area real estate agent, and welcome to Brighton in Hollister. Now, why am I here? In general, when people want new construction single family homes, there's only a few areas that are suitable for places under a million dollars. Those are places like Hollister, those are places like Tracy, they are places like Brentwood, but at the end of the day, they all have their own pros and cons. So it ultimately just depends where are you based, where is your work, where is your friends and family, what do you like to do, and any of these regions can work. So today, we're gonna to be touring two different model homes. So depending on your interest, feel free to skip to it, feel free to rewind what you may be interested in. But hey, if you're returning to my channel, welcome back. If you're brand new, my name is Spencer Sue, and I'm a Bay Area real estate agent here in this market. And I am here to put out content to be able to be the very best resource for those of you that are looking to make decisions to have the Bay Area as a real estate destination. Now, when it comes to new construction or pre owned homes, there is no cost or downside with using a realtor like myself to be able to help negotiate the best deals for you because I have leverage with all the different deals that I do with all these communities and builders. That being said, I do need to go with you for the very first time to ensure you are properly registered. That is especially the case when it comes to new construction. So if you like any of these videos that I do, do not go on your own. Just send me a text. I'm gonna make it work for you. Don't think it's a hassle. Whether you wanna go for it or not, I'm just here to be a resource and to be able to help you navigate with your journey. Be sure to subscribe to the channel as I'm gonna be putting out new content every single week. And today, let's go take a look at the model homes together. Now, what I like about the labeling that KB does is they don't go with like plan one, plan two, plan three, plan A, plan B. They just go with, all right, what is the actual square footage of the home? And that's the plan. So this is gonna be the plan 2017. It's a three bed, two and a half bath, two car garage, two stories as you will see, 2017 square feet. And this is actually an incredible floor plan because it's just simply two levels. You have a nice pantry, open kitchen and open floor plan. You have a really spacious family and dining area. And as you go upstairs, all of your bedrooms will be upstairs, but you still have like this separate, almost like a den space. So it could be used for an office. It could be used for a studio. You saw a dedicated laundry room. And lots of natural light when it comes to the bedrooms. Okay, and the second of the two models is plan 2538. Now this is gonna be the largest of the floor plans. They can range between four to five bedrooms, two and a half to three bathrooms, two car garage, two stories, 2,538 square feet. You can see that the layout is a little bit different than the other one. But if you want something a little bit bigger, this will be it for you. Now, you don't lose your walk-in kitchen pantry and you can see that your kitchen is a little bit bigger than the previous one that we just saw. What's good about this one is that a lot of people have been desiring a bedroom downstairs, so it's great for in-laws or guests. But in this case, you have that full bathroom downstairs too. As you go on up, take a look at this incredible primary. Now, a lot of styles these days, not just have dual sinks, but they actually have your walk-in closet through the bathroom. What do you think about this style? Now, this is a huge walk-in closet, 
but are you a big fan of this? Or do you prefer your walk-in closet to be separated from your bathroom? Leave in the comments below. Here you got a nice linen closet in your bathroom, so there's even more storage. Here you can see another family room that can be used upstairs, could be an entertainment studio. Here's a shared bathroom. Now one thing about all of these units, because of how popular electric vehicle charging is, they're all equipped already with wiring. So you have a 40 amp electric vehicle charging. All right, so there you have it. These are the two model homes and there are many other options here. Whether you like these that are more this court style or take a look at my previous video that I did in the same exact community by the same builder, you're gonna see other options that are a little bit more expensive but they're gonna have a bigger lot. So it's really depending on your budget and your preference. But here's the great thing right now, because Hollister's a little bit further out, there's some amazing opportunities that these builders are doing because they have many that are moving ready today. So right now they're actually overcompensating with a lot of different buyer incentives. And often there's gonna be room for me to be able to help negotiate and leverage my relationship with a builder like KB, Pulte, or any of these builders in this area. I'm happy to work that out for you. So before I do anything else, I'm gonna put my contact details right over here. So do reach out and let's go over a game plan together. I'm so glad you're on this channel. Feel free to preview some of the other videos and I'll see you in the next home tour. Bye now.